Hey guys, welcome to RP Feed. In today's video, we are going to talk about code promotion activity in Automation 360. Code promotion activity is performed for moving your bots across environments. For example, you are developing your code in Dev, then you have to move that code to QA and from QA to Prod. So these are three different environments, and you have to move your bot code from one environment to another environment. So for that purpose, uh, we do code promotion activities, right? Now this is the agenda of this video. Like I'll, I'll let you know what is code promotion for some of you guys who are not familiar with code promotion activities. Then the prerequisite to enable your bot promotion from control room and con the permissions needed uh, to perform this activity and getting rid of the import export process. So prior to using this feature, which is which I am going to show you in this video, and that is called promote bot feature. Uh, what people used to do is people uh, were creating a BLM package for example like you were to promote three or four files from dev to QA what you will do is you will go ahead and select all those files build a package export that package from your dev control room and you will go to QA control room and then upload that package or import that package over there so we'll, we'll get rid of this this step and we can directly promote our code from the control room and at last i'll show you the demo what is code promotion code promotion is the process or an activity of moving code from one environment to another environment like dev to qa or qa to production so in, in a360 we need to promote the bots from lower environments so lower environments are dev and qa these are lower environments and then we move code from lower environments to higher environment for example generally developer builds their code in development environment and then they promote it to qa so that uh, uat user acceptance testing can happen on the qa environment and then everything is fine on qa then we move to production so this this is how it uh, the setup is done at the control room level for some of the organization they they just have dev and qa uh, combined like they they have a single instance of their lower environment that is dev and qa combined and they build there they test it their code or bots there and then they move it to production but ideal is you should have three different environments moving to the prerequisites so in order to set up this code promotion feature or bot promote feature you need to set up a few step like you need to follow few step a few steps to uh, in your control room so these are some prerequisites so basically you must be a platform admin to perform these activities okay and these are the five steps that you need to perform you need to log into control room as an administrator then navigate to these particular this uh, path for example we are interested in board promotion setting then we have to edit that board promotion setting and enter the control room url for example you are in dev control room then from dev to qa you need to move your codes and then you need to enter the qa control room url over here similarly from in your QA environment you have to enter production in uh, control room URL and then click on save that's it moving on to the next this is how this will look like I'll, I'm not going to perform this activity it's very straightforward like you need to log into control room as an admin and then click on settings and you'll get this option bot promotion settings and you have to just uh, add your control room URL okay moving to the next this is control room permissions the what are permissions are needed at the control room level so uh, again you either log in here as a cr admin or a bot creator with these permissions like you should have export bot permission and all the folder level permissions for example run and schedule check in check out view content clone and delete from public all these should be enabled at the folder level for which you want to perform the uh, code promotion then the target CR user must have import bot permissions. So for example, uh, what is the target CR over here? Uh, QA. Like QA control room is our target con control room uh, where we want to import the code, right? Import bots. So our target control room user must have import bot permissions. Moving on to the next. So I've just uh, highlighted at high level, uh, like all the folder level permissions the user that is going to perform the code promotion right uh, should have all these accesses at the all these accesses or permissions at the folder level now coming to this point like we are with using this promote bot feature we'll get rid of the 
import uh, sorry export and import right? this this feature will avoid multi step export and import process when we are moving bots across different control room environments we don't need to perform this activity now so let's move on to the demo i am in the dev control room now and go to manage bot and click on promote option you'll see the list of available bots from which you can select we'll for this demo we'll go with one bot file named demo test and then we'll go and select dependency there are no dependency and you can see the bot is selected and there is only one package in that bot that's message box if there were a dependency they would have been loaded here and this is the promotion name so promote and date time and you have two options skip the bot file or overwrite the existing bot file so you can choose accordingly and then target control room whatever we have configured um, that's a QA control room URL and then username and the API key this is the user which is registered in QA control room with import bot permissions so the promotion has started you can check in your audit log as well there might be an entry of this activity let's move to QA control room now and as you can see here the bot is now promoted or uh, the code is available in QA environment so similarly you can also follow the same step for moving this bot to production now from your QA control room you choose the same option and select those respective bot files and proceed with the code promotion as we did it from dev to QA right it's same same steps same process that you need to follow however here the only thing which changes target control room url now we have not configured here so that's why i'm just closing this out i hope the demo was useful for you if you have got any questions kindly reach out to me at the below mentioned email id or comment below this video in case you like this video please subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends thank you thank you so much